Hello everyone, this is Sispity's Mad Cat Sphere, and I just want to show these fun clips of me uh, rolling this log with telekinesis with my intention. Um, I'm doing it outside as you can see, and um, I'm d I also brought it in and did it inside, it was kind of a little crazy, but, you know, I did it, you know, just a challenge, you know. And, but this is the thing is though, is that I was able to do these log rolls back when I was just a beginner in psychokinesis, just barely, I was barely learning how to uh, spin a side wheel, and I, and I achieved it, but I was doing these log rolls when I was just barely six months, six months in, or just barely, barely a year, and I was able to do it, and uh, I recommend you guys giving it a try, try uh, outside and inside, if you, uh, if you guys can't do it inside, stick with doing it outside, it's the same, because it's a heavy object, and it's very challenging, but the thing is, though, is that, um, I recommend you guys giving it a try, finding a log or something like that, so, uh, um, finding a log that um, is kind of irregular a little bit, like all logs, they have the bark is very, like, um, jagged, and that helps to kind of uh, have the log on, on a hinge, like a side wheel is on a hinge, you know, it's like a little pin head, and a log that's kind of jagged, that's irregular, its surface, will help you to kind of uh, manipulate it and your intention to connect with it to make it roll away or towards you, you know. And um, as, you, as you can see there, uh, I had some luck and I had a little small one right there. And um, but, but all logs are like that. And I was doing this when I was just barely into spinning side wheels. So the thing is, though, is that what I want to say in this video is that, is that, you know, all you need is just a lot of confidence. The reason why I was able to roll this log so well and get some any footage was because I was just very enthusiastic. I was working with something that was very big, very impressive. And that enthusiasm blended with my already uh, my knowledge with spinning the side wheel, the, the belief and uh, the faith that I was spinning a side wheel, that knowledge that I gained from spinning a side wheel, how to do it, helped me to roll this log. I was just very ambitious, and it helped and it worked, and 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 also because of the irregular the irregularity of the log itself also helped too. But you have to, as you as you guys know, you know have a great anticipation, feel it, send that that energy toward it, send that belief that faith toward the object be patient because the more patient you have the more results you'll see the faster results you'll see even with large objects i was a beginner when i did these things and you guys can do it too you guys can roll these big ass logs as i did just find something like this or like like a trash can is not i don't think a trash can is good because it's um um, it, it's not irregular enough, and it doesn't roll well, and it's kind of very heavy, and it's just a very different dimensional object, different shape. So I recommend just working with a log because it's it's an organic thing. It's it's already decaying and it's already being cut, you know. But it's still from the earth, so it still connects a little bit. Still has some energy that can reflect your energy and, and absorb it. And um, you know, and um, it's just a big, real big object, and it's very heavy. But because it has irregular shape uh, bark it allows your chi energy to move it because it's on a hinge maybe like on three pieces three sharp three sharp points it's sitting on or one big piece of bark it's sitting on so it can still flip over you have to believe that it will roll you have to believe that it will roll and you have to believe that any roll that you get is from you just like you guys have seen my from my videos you guys know my tutorials you guys know i keep on saying the same thing over and over again but this is the truth i was able to do these rolls back when i was just six months or a year in of doing psych telekinesis doing side wheels i was able to roll this log way before i was able to roll a can but the reason why was because I was just very ambitious, I believed in myself, I had faith, and I knew how to create that proper balance of having um, the ambition and ego, but that humble, um, insightful knowledge of knowing how to move a side wheel. Because all you need, because all you need is just to move a side wheel. With the power of the knowledge of moving a side wheel, you can do these large objects. That's how psychonesis is. The same energy that you use to spin a side wheel is the same energy that's needed and required to move large objects. You, what boosts that, what gives that a boost is that your faith 
and your determination and your enthusiasm and your ambition but you have to properly balance all of that so that it can be no other no emotion or ego ego is not higher than humbleness they're both equally on an equal plane so let's watch the videos and learn read my posts watch my tutorials read the description on my biggest best best telekinesis video read the description learn don't let me repeat myself you guys know what I'm about just give it a try and don't push yourself don't get frustrated take your time if you can't do these big things stick with side wheels side wheels is your foundation like I said so thank you guys God bless want to share it with you I was able to do things do these things when I was a beginner you guys too give it a try bye